Hey, what's up, everybody? I'm Cash, and welcome to another episode of the Drawing with Cash show. I, I dab a lot on this thing, so uh, here's the deal. Here. First of all, I just want to start by saying, Oh my god, thank you so much for all the support and the comments and the subscriptions. And holy shit, the channel, my main channel, Cash, has been growing really fast like weirdly so fast like I've, I've, we've gained over like 3,000 plus subscribers over the past three or four days that is like the fastest growth this channel has ever seen and so and also this channel my second channel drawing with cash is like 285 subscribers yay so anyways it's just, uh, one of the most frequently asked questions in that video was what pen do I use what supplies do I use or something like that so anyways I just want to give you guys a quick overview of all the tools that I use and I'm a very minimalistic type of dude I don't use a lot of art supplies I, I, I keep it very simple not that I not that I want to it's, it's because our supplies are pretty damn expensive down here so anyways let me give you a quickie little tour of my minimalistic art setup so here it goes so uh, this is all there is to it pretty much this and this. I'll come to that later. So the pen that I mostly I used to use was this little thing. It's a Cello Fine Grip S Pen. So this is the ballpoint pen that I highly recommend people use. This is what I use, and uh, this is a pencil that I also use. Usually I use a Stedler. Come on, man, focus. By the way, these things are like one take, so I'm sorry. So this is like the Dixon Ticonderoga HB2 pencil, it's a number 2 pencil and uh, this is the lead that I use for a mechanical pencil that I lost so yeah there's that and uh, I'll get to the syringe a bit in a bit and uh, yeah these are the new addi additions, 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 what do you, what do you say? This is the pen that I use right now currently, you know what, yeah just hold on a second okay good don't fall don't fall by the way these shows are again one take so i don't edit these things they're supposed to be quick and informative 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 okay uh so yeah this is a big round stick pen that i use this is the pen that i recommend uh, right now these days that people if you want to you know do art like me or something like that this is the pen i recommend people use this is the one i used in the art of no not this this is the one i used in the art of daily sketch for the old man and for the title in the art of daily sketch video and also the uh, the one step at a time video this was the brush i lost the other brush so this thing is not filled yet it's like a water brush that's got a uh, This is like a water brush, it's got like you put ink into this thingy and you put this thing on top and uh, yeah, you're set to go. This thing is supposed to have a, what do you call that, cap on top of that, but uh, I've lost that as well. And uh, <laughs> uh, so, uh, but, but, the, but the, this is the pencil, this is the pencil I use, recommend people buy, it's a Stedler Mars Lumograph pencil it's a 2h pencil that i use uh, use for you know ever since the dawn of time <laughs> ever since i was in school and all that stuff and i used to do realism artworks and drawings and all that stuff this is the pencil that i was i used to use and still use and i recommend people try and by the way if you think i'm, I'm sponsored in any way by these people no <laughs> no <laughs> and uh, this is a pencil brush pen that I've used to create most of the artwork in one, on the one step at a time video and also uh, yeah well, just that video and also the other videos that I'm making and the one that I'm making right now like it's gonna be kill it's gonna come like you know to a day or two so uh, this is the way I think it's a pencil brush pen it comes with uh, uh, what what do you call that stuff refillable refillable I don't know the term it comes with these cartridge cartridge yeah, kind of like that. I haven't warmed up with my voices okay <laughs> these comes up with these uh, cartridges uh, which you put in in this thing and uh, to do all that stuff and uh, the thing is these things are uh, you know 
uh, they are expensive so what I use is this syringe and a Rorito ink I don't know where the ink go shit why did I open this just hold on a second so this thing is uh, you know I'll, I'll bring the Rorito ink yeah this is the ink so this is the Rorito ink it's a no not Rorito it's Rotring oh Rotring so not Rorito I use the Rorito ink put the syringe in fill it up like this and put it into the cartridge fill it down and that's how I refill these things if you want me to do a specific video on that on this channel let me know uh, so yeah this is by the way the most expensive water supply that I own at the moment <laughs> Pentel is pretty expensive, that's what they have been told. Uh, okay, and uh, in terms of paper, for sketching, I use this 80 GSM A4 bound papers, the, like printer papers, for like random sketching. Like, and also, I uh, the sketchbook that I use a lot is this little bad boy, let's say. Is, it, is the angle good on all that stuff? I don't think so yeah cool so this is a campap a5 viro pp creative sketchbook campap a5 sketchbook 110 gsm 60 sheets and it's got like two little slots of it and there's like sketchbook number four which i've completed i have yet to order them uh so oh yeah this is by the way uh a sample sketch of yoda that was done on this big pen I like the texture and the you know the it's it's not too flowy or not too rigid it's got a very pencilish feel to it but it's also dark enough so I kind of like this thing so anyways this is a compact sketchbook that I use somebody in the house okay no he's in the house but I'm hearing noises and he goes to check if someone broke in or something like that but I need to finish the video before that um, Oh yeah, this is the paper that I use for all my artwork. It's a Bristol, Canson Bristol A3, 180 GSM sheets. It comes in pack of five or something like that. And uh, yeah, so those are all pretty much, I don't use color pencils. If I do use, I use these old Faber-Castell color me grip pencils for sketching. And I usually color on Photoshop, so uh, so yeah, those are the art supplies, man. This, these, this, it's pretty much there to it. Yes, it's it's pretty much my li whole life is a cheap art supply challenge. I've made that joke already, but yeah, I'm still making that. <laughs> right, anyway, so yeah, so that's the pen. These are the pens and the stuff that I'm using. Thank you for subscribing, watching this video, and let me know down below in the comment section what should I talk about, what should I share, what should, what, what questions do you want to ask me and uh, which I which you would like answered I want to help I want to let people know what I think and how I do stuff and all that thing so yeah thank you for watching this video and uh, I'm, 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 I'm releasing a new video on my main channel in like a day or two so it's pretty damn good and I worked <laughs> really hard on that thing for the past couple of weeks so anyways yeah have an eye out for that Thank you for watching this video again and I'll see you guys in another episode. Bye bye. By the way, this is the thing I usually do on this channel. I just like put my hands and like, close it and you're done. Bye. So, a while ago I received a mail from YouTube and it read, Hey Cash, what's up? It's YouTube.